hopefully. Let's see, let's see. Might just mess around here a little bit. Now I've got the deck, so I just need to work out what I want to use. Robot has been doing well, so I'll keep running that for now, I think. I mean, why not? Control it's always good. Certainly not the best hand. And that's not great. Not great at all. Opponent plays nothing, we play nothing. Sounds like we're on a roll. And ping one to face. You can eat my one ping all day. Hmm. Just playing them with the ramp that turn might be bad, so we'll just throw that out. Means they have to make a decision. And that kind of sucks. Rehab had to be the perfect play for them. Now I guess I do this. Not for many other options. Probably the more beneficial of the options. Draconic for healing out the wild zoo, why don't ya? Now let's go a little bit of damage. Average probably two with this most of the time. Hmm. Much to use these ping damage. I mean, we got the rev, we got the wardrobe, we got the temptress. Why not? Okay. Fafnir. Well, this dragon's running a trash card. I don't know why you'd want to run Fafnir, honestly, but I suppose it's a option. Certainly not a good one, but good against what I've got because I don't really have anything to deal with it, unfortunately. Uh, maybe I just play stuff. Just playing stuff should be fine. So my best bet would be to draw my second Temptress. Kiss isn't going to do me much good. Although, we will be pretty close, so as long as they don't have, what, anything, 
like Genesis, I guess, was really bad lethal. Um, Sap could be okay. That healing's gonna be a bitch, though. How do I deal with this? Uh, rev into Vampiric. Well, Vampiric into Rev. Still puts me in lethal range of a lot of things. Might do it this way. I don't want to be in lethal range. I prefer to stay, stay free. Would you be aiming for, I guess? Temptress would be nice. Ah, Grim does the job pretty well, though. Buys me just a little bit of time. the Lucifer play. Going for as much damage as they can get. Let's use that first. Queen. Queen plus Evolve is okay. I mean, I'm dead to... I'm not quite dead to Grim, and I can kill off that anyway. Mm. I mean, otherwise it would just be Rev, and Rev on its own. With the oh, I couldn't play the Vamp Queen because of the Bathman anyway, so... Maybe it's just better to hold this. I mean, we set up lethal, lethal if we draw into Temptress Vampire, but that's a long shot. Hey, Fire, what's up? Oh, Grim, yay. No, I didn't give me a mic. Same one that I've used from the beginning. <laughs> that is fine. I shouldn't be. I should have fixed all that. It looks like it's gone all wonky on me. Oh, uh, that's why. Was picking up the wrong mic. Pretty easy fix, honestly. I was picking up my um, webcam mic instead of the actual microphone. Hang on, dragon. Now I'm really hoping that video I recorded earlier today isn't stuffed up. We have to check that over, I reckon. Because that would be really annoying. Um, I don't have a fan with any of these. I'll give this a shot in ranked. Hopefully it's all sorted now. Shouldn't be anywhere near as loud. If I reckon. It's pretty dead today. Usually we have more people in here by now. It's like being 10 minutes. Usually we have at least a few, but. It's 
looking pretty dead at the moment. Hopefully in the next little bit we'll get people in here. What have I got? Fairies, more fairies. Infinite fairies. Tetra is so edgy, yeah. Sounds like the story of my life. Okay. Can't really use path. Unless I'm drawing to... No, that won't work. Ah, oh, that feels way too good to pass up though. I'm thinking Altered Fate. Straight out, just Altered Fate the board. Dump that hand into this hand. Dump that hand. Alright. Not far to go. And we've got plenty of fairy stocking cards. So now we just need to control enough. Hopefully draw another Alter Fate. Not Alter Fate, sorry. Um, Path of Purgatory. In the next few draws. Would work out really nicely. Mm, these elf childs. So tempting. You can see what my luck's like. Alright, not the best. The return does give me that value. Yeah, you can't go wrong with double altered fate. I mean, it works out pretty nicely. <laughs> Greg has arrived. <laughs> Actually, I don't mind the PTP deck. It's quite enjoyable to play. It's one of the few variants of Forest I only ever could enjoy. Um, so we've got that in our hand now. We just need to make sure we've got enough. Playing that, stock our hand slightly. Elf child, elf child, and draw. Puts enough on board, gets us some value, and Aaron's perfect for our next couple turns. With Brambles, hopefully we can get some trade up value if they don't play anything too crazy. I'll settle for that. <laughs> Just trying to think of how I'll handle this. Uh, we'll get rid of that. And we'll get rid of that. Use these as our trades. And evolve trade. Clears the board. And we have fairies coming out of us, but that's not too big an issue. And zombies aren't going to want to collide with these, so Hector isn't going to be a great play. And Brambles will be active next turn, so if I want to mix it with the Rhino or the Aaron, we should be fine. <laughs> Greg making use of those epic emotes, as per usual. Alright, so we're six, six shadows away from path being activatable. That will grant us one when it goes. That grants us one, that grants us one, so that gives us three. We're three off, assuming I can ram the roach, I can gain at least another one. 
and then all I need to do is hope that I can use the rest. Okay, so that's one. And that'll probably be two. Um, do I just take it here? Probably. I mean, we're gonna get two shadows next turn, so all I really need is a couple spells. Well, one spell really. I can use the roach as fodder. Provided this dies next turn, which I suspect it will, because we are versing Shadow after all. So all I need is to trigger one. So I can play two fairies, play the roach, just fine, path to purgatory, get four damage to their face, six on everything else. Now just play from here. I mean there's not much they can really do against the path to purgatory. PTP Forest. Definitely not a problem. Next matchup, Dragon. Uh, not too confident in my Dragon matchup. <laughs> Drop the wills. Alright, this hand's pretty alright. I can handle that. Early game fairy circle. Maybe even drop the Fairy Whisper next turn. Mm. <laughs> Fill a hand up a bit just in case we do draw Altered Fate, in which case it'll become really good. Because we'll mostly only be losing Fairies, which I'm pretty alright with. Can't play that without burning stuff, really, but I'm probably gonna play anyway. Fill our hand up. I mean, we do burn whatever comes next, but it's a risk I'm gonna have to take. As long as it's not altered, I'm happy. I only really need one path to pull off a decent play, so I'm not too concerned with burning those. Yeah, Bramble's burn kind of sucks. It's going to be too close if I play that, isn't it? Oh, I'm going to have to do though. We'll give them the... Give them the thing. They're going to be up to it anyway next turn. <laughs> Hehehe. 
Oh, dragon. Come on, dragon. What do you got to show me today? Alright, that's good. I like that spot of trading. Ooh, lucky me. Can't afford to play Glimmer. Alright, time to start throwing fairies. Hit him right in the face. Go for that damage where we can. What you got to show me now, Dragon? Turn 8. We got some crazy ass shit, because I don't enjoy crazy ass shit. I'd much rather you didn't play crap, but. Cycle Hill into something would be annoying. Dragon Summoner. How does that feel? I mean, if we draw into. Yeah, if we draw into Altered. Fairy Circle, fills the hand up. Pretty much all the way by that point. I could probably get away with playing another fairy, playing the glimmering and then altering. Maybe. I don't know which way I want to do this now. Don't really want to use the crystal, but if I have to use it to get rid of this, then I'm not really gonna have a choice. Although, if Elf Child does the right target, I could be good anyway. And it does do pretty well for me. And there's Altered. Is it worth playing it? Probably not this turn, honestly. As I'm gonna have to ram these. And I did just fill my hand, whoops. Well, that wasn't the best play. But I can just restock, so why not? One. I guess I'll play two. Just in case. May as well. Fifteen to go. Got the potential to play the H and L altered fate next turn. Oh wow. This will be interesting. Very interesting. Had to draw my other altered fate though, didn't I? H and L. Path to Purgatory. Alter Fate. Draw a whole new hand. Don't draw anything I can actually use, unfortunately. Outside of maybe Glimmer. Draw into another Altered? Nope. Well, I'm probably dead next turn thanks to that then. I mean, they do have to get past that, but I feel like that's not going to be hard. What other option do I really have? None. I mean, I can Roach. It's not going to do much, but it's a play. May as well just play Brambles, though. But I am going to fill my hands, so that might have been a bad choice. Ah, we'll see. They're either going to kill me or they're not. I really need to draw my second altar. Then I would have had at least a half decent shot here. That's good, having them hit that. That, on the other hand, isn't so good. If it's Yod, I suppose we have a chance. Okay. 
Jabberwock, that could be bad. Ooh, okay, okay. Think, think, think. Roach isn't going to be enough on its own. Playing anything else isn't really going to be enough. I can't ram much, so that's disappointing. Um, the Ancient Elf is at play, I guess. I really need to get four, though. And I still need to be able to hit those. Or block the board off. Now I just need two. Okay. Two shouldn't be too hard. Turn that. Draw a card. Burns whatever I draw. Probably not the best play. Uh, Roach. Hit one of these jab. Still need one, which is unfortunate. Shit. It's gonna take too long. I think I got it in time. Thank God for that. <laughs> that was worry. Now I just need to survive this turn. Can I do that? Oh, come on. Alright, down to five, but they everything gets halved, so Bahamut and stuff's still a bad threat. During the next turn, okay. During the next turn. It's not good, but it's also not that bad either. Um, yeah, so keeping myself out of range, being able to trade, hit them in the face. For five, six, awesome. I was a little worried, but... PDP Forest holding up. It really is dead in here today though, other than you two, like, that's surprising. Usually it's not quite this dead. It's kinda lonely in here. <laughs> Then your forest somehow? Oh yeah. PDB forest is always great. It's been doing well lately. No one really expects it, so they expect an easy matchup, and then you go into the late Path to Purgatory plays and they just kind of cry. Once pe If people start realizing that Path to Purgatory forest is a legitimate threat, and they'll start teching against stuff like that, and then you won't have much to surprise anymore. Which is sad. Essentially, you mostly just play it as control. It's not really any issue. And you can't usually tell until Altered Fate or Path is dropped. Because it plays just like most other Roach Forest decks. It's annoying. Take a little more damage now to get a better advantage in the future. <laughs> Two hours to kill a eh, Greg, that's pretty good. Okay, defend that. I'm gonna decide with what's worth playing more. I might go for the Bramble Fairy play instead. I'll hold that till next turn in case I need to get rid of something else. This is neutral rune, so as long as I can keep this board under control, I should be okay. 
And this fairy should do a good job of that. If that hits, that dice before it die kills this. If I hit that, then it's instant killed anyway. Hey, breadcrumbs, what's up? So we're gonna get okay trades. I mean, even in the next turn, it's gonna be pretty good. That's a little bit of a problem, but other than that, I think I'm gonna be okay. One. Might use that. <laughs> Gets rid of that. Play another fairy. Draw a couple more cards. Okay. How to handle this now? Play the ancient, maybe? Wise mode isn't mod. No, wise mode isn't mod. Wise mode just chills. I could make it a mod, but I just haven't bothered. It doesn't seem to need it, which is good. And, and no, I'm not. I'm playing Path to Purgatory Forest, which, let's just say, is a fair bit better than that. Nothing here seems good, though, right now. This <laughs> actual cards in it? Yeah, that's true. It does have actual cards in it. Very tempted to return that. What's next turn? Turn 6. I suppose I can use the heal. Just seems like a waste though. Um, might just play that. More fairies. We'll see what happens. I mean, they've only got two cards in hand. <laughs> yeah, that's, it was it was enjoyable to play through until I got to like the sixth loss in a row, and I was like, oh well, this is a lot harder than I thought. And then I pulled out that one win against um, Shadow, and was like, yay, life isn't terrible. <laughs> Can you use this? Yeah, I know, it was really close most games. They were really close. I need to get rid of that before I can do anything dangerous. Does mean this carrot's pain, but... Eh, sacrifices. I haven't faced neutral rune with this deck yet, so it's an interesting matchup for me. So I'm thinking this is going to be pretty good. H and going to do some work next turn for sure. Probably could have done that differently, honestly. Sometimes RNG will help, yeah. Sometimes. Sometimes it'll help. I actually need to get Altered Fate into my hand. There's Gilgamesh. Okay. Good to see that used in that, that way. I'd rather see it used like that than any other way. Um, maybe we can just play this. That way I get to hold the evolve, I get the heal, and I don't have to trade into anything yet. And it acts as a nice ward. Why not? I've got a video for this deck coming out in a few days, so this should be interesting. Will the forest for six, clears the board. Next 
surely, yeah, I got seven, so it's funny. I was like, did I take through the board? Was I wrong? No, I don't think I was. That's um some variation of neutral rune, I'm guessing, with a Earthrite hybrid sort of combo in it, I'm guessing. Nearly everything they've played so far has been reminiscent of neutral rune, but... Maybe it's some, yeah, Earthrite hybrid style deck? Definitely interesting, but... Whether it'll work well is a whole different story. I think we win, don't we? No, not quite. Um, actually... Yeah, no, we win. Not the most, um, conventional win, but... So, yeah, they do seem to be used pretty uselessly, don't we? Whoops, forgot, because we only evolved once. Ha! <laughs> that was funny. Be more entertaining if I had to fuck that up, but pretty sure we're gonna win anyway. I mean, they've got a top deck. The chances of them winning now, pretty low. I don't know what they'd need. They'd need something absolutely crazy. Calatimus. No, that's five and lower, so yeah, they'd have to trade and clear board. Then they'd be left with pretty much nothing. Yay, 2,000. It's only taken me half the month to get to 2,000. Mind you, I haven't seriously tried yet. I really do need to dedicate some time and just, like, grind my way all the way up. As far as I can. Is that interesting? <laughs> yeah. I'm actually curious as to whether it's the de one of the decks I think it could be. Just have to take a quick squiz. At the recent tournament decks. Let's see. Tournament. No, tournament decks is what I want. Uh. No, that's. Sorry, I want this one. 13th NA. Don't want that one. Just these ones. Um... Okay, I'd s Not that deck, that's for sure. Okay, it's not what I thought it might have been, but... Definitely, definitely interesting. Started watching Death Note. Death Note's pretty good. I enjoyed watching it. It's not that deck either. Hmm. Curious. Okay, turn one. Where we go for turn two. Okay, Brambles gets me the trade. Brambles actually a surprisingly good card. I didn't expect it to be anywhere near as good as it is. Hmm. I mean, they end their turn and I do lose Brambles, which sucks. Um. Don't really have any other play other than maybe nature's guiding into the brambles and hopefully being able to use it again next turn and hopefully they leave these alone. I don't know, we'll see. I think this is the only decent option I had left. <laughs> Jojo is one of the few series I can never get into. Yeah, 
All right. Don't want to overstock my hand though, and that's what that will do. Leave up the merman as two. Trade into the rest. Keep enough fairies on board. Let's go. Yes! Watch Dragon Maid. Dragon Maid's so adorable. It's one that you literally sit back and just let it happen. I really enjoyed Ke um, Kobayashi's Dragon Maid. It was great. Just something fun. The art style was cute. Definitely one of those Moe Blob type animes, but it was a relaxing break between other more serious things at the time. Okay, two damage. <laughs> That's true, people do loot it anyway. Use this. Still gonna take more damage that I don't want to take. But at least this way it does threaten. We can always play Crystalline on 6 for 3 health. Not drawing into the, um. What are they? The Altered Fates really makes it hard to pull off Path to Purgatory effectively. Six. Great, now I draw it right when I don't really want it. Alright, at least I can limit their board. Pretty happy with that. And we do have the altered now, so if I have to use it, I guess I will. Dance. Wow. That's annoying. Three health, dead to Gilgamesh. Can play the here, but I have got to sacrifice something to use it properly. My best route is surviving, I think. It's awesome to deal with the crystal. If I can get away with trading, I might be able to make use of the roach. Okay, that's fine with me. Oh, that's not so fine though. Having the angel. <laughs> well, one loss in four games isn't so bad with Purgatory so far. <laughs> Greg, you can't just recruit people to live with you. That's not how life works. Forest on forest, okay. Breadcrumbs came back, yay! Mm, not the best hand. Definitely could have done better. Because I got Fairy Circle, Water Fairy is a fine play. Then I can go Fairy Circle, Water Fairy, Tack, whatever I want to do really. Of course they have to play Elf Child May. <laughs> Alright, start stocking our hands with those fairies.
Where am I gonna go? There. Great. Altered fate. May as well go for a max hand altered fate. And that was actually a really good draw. Turn 3, 10 shadows built up. Not too shabby. <laughs> More fairies. Let's stock this hand back up. Just in case we draw into something good. I'm running one tier and now I've drawn it two games in a row. How great is that? Are we going to use the evolve? I get a feeling that's what's coming. Interested about dragon lollies? There's not much to say, they're dragon lollies. The perfect combination of badass and adorable. Alright, we can start trading with this. And then if I want to play H Nelf next turn, that's always available to me. <laughs> hey, it could be worse, it could be pawn. I mean that that wouldn't be a great thing to walk in on. Mind you, I did once watch Two Love Roo during school hours when I was in high school, so that was that was a moment to explain. <laughs> Getting the trades here might be more important. Ah, I forgot that I can't trade into that. Whoops! Mistakes were made. That's alright. <laughs> it gets raped, that's great. The one scene in Sword Art Online where there's actually really awkward sexual tension. <laughs> On your prony stage. The stage that no one should ever speak of. Uh, it's actually pretty alright. I can use the fairies to my advantage here. Alright, they're gonna try and roach me. <laughs> hmm. Now I can use the crystal next turn. Just need to block this up enough so they can't really do anything. I mean, they're gonna lose Bramble Effect. Which is pretty shitty for them. So unless they have another Bramble in hand, they should have a decent amount of board advantage. Even with their Roach, they're gonna need to find a way around this stuff. Alright, using h and for that way. Double Roach. Okay. So one way to do things, that's for sure. Shitty trade though. This is gonna be great. <laughs> Concede because you just lost two roaches. Back up to 2k. 
Still trying to get. Oh, don't want that. Still trying to get my other sleeve though. Bladed hedgehog sleeve. Must obtain. <laughs> Mega animes. One of the few animes I could really never like much. Don't know why. I've watched a few that have mecha elements, but not full-blown, you know, mecha wars all the time. Like, I'd class something such as, like, Code Gears as a light mecha because it mainly focused on the abilities over the mechs. They were just kind of a subplot. Even though that was probably the one I, I watched the most of when it comes to any form of mecha. Fairy Circle. Because circles! And fairies. Hmm. Strangely okay with this play. You've never seen a mecha anime. Wow. Did <laughs> I? I don't know, Greg, if they do, but I certainly know that Samuel L. Jackson does. And I would hope by now that everyone had seen that meme, because that was an amazing meme. <laughs> Even Gillian, one I never watched. Well, that's not true. I've seen enough scenes from it to know the premise, but I've never actually watched it. Three. Hmm. Hit face and hope for good luck. Sounds good to me. Samuel Jackson is God. He is. <laughs> Dragon Oracle. Dragon Scyther. Okay, so they're looking to kill this off. Depending on whether I just want to alter fate this entire hand and start from scratch. But it might be a waste to do that. I'm not really sure, but if I don't use alter fate now, I'm never going to get a decent chance to use it either, so. Now we'll do it. Well, at least we drew half decently. Oh dear. The chat devolves into the ultimate hentai forum where hentai is just widely accepted by everyone. That's my kind of forum. Turn play, draw play. I was going to question what we're talking about. Oh, they'll probably see the chat come up. After all, we have it on screen for a reason. The whole purpose of me having go on screen is so when I upload it to YouTube, people actually understand what we're talking about and why. Mind you, by now, if people people who watch my streams on YouTube don't know the kind of things we discuss, then they probably haven't been around long. And probably won't stay around long. Um, we're going to have a full hand, so Will of the Forest grants us a clear, but is it worth it? Probably not, but I'm going to probably do it anyway, so why not? Hmm. Fairies. Because love. I just need to out this dragon. Come on, dragon. Don't do anything crazy now. You're my, one of my few bad matchups here. Yurf is here? No, not Yurf. I don't know who Yurf is. <laughs> He's cancer. <laughs> I guess that is true. 
stating the obvious like it wasn't wasn't obvious to begin with. Um, how do I want to play this hand? I'm dead to a yod? Oh, no I'm not, I'm still alive. Oh well. That makes sense why I don't understand. Take the glimmering draw. I'm gonna have to play the other elf anyway, but. Use an evolve to make it a threat, since we've got the, um, Eren anyway. And we may as well just play stuff. I mean, our best bet would be that we draw into Alter Fate. We'd always be pushing. Pushing um, Path to Purgatory by that point if we draw into Altered Fate. Ooh, Polyroar, perfect. That's the kind of thing I want to come up against right now. This should be interesting. Might return one of these maze. Just for that draw power. You got three hectares. Oh boy, that's awesome. Let's see what Dragon does now. I'm trying to think of a crazy lethal combo. I can't think of any. Which is good. That thing still has its effect, doesn't it? because it's got the flag. Which means if they trade into it... Oh, this should be good. That's gone. Um, may as well use this. It's just like unlimited Evo points. Go! There shouldn't be an overdraw from this. <laughs> so I just need Altered Fate. That's literally it. Altered Fate would pretty much close this at this point. Okay, now it's basically the only thing I can use. Mm, crystals are actually still pretty good. What do I do now? Not that, that makes a big difference. Okay, let's see. Let's see. We've got the board for now. That's dead either way. We only need six to activate path. We should be able to get four here. So I only need two more, which I hopefully can do... If I get lucky on the draw, maybe. I know I can get one from the Vol trade. I'm playing... Just play, I don't know if playing path actually counted or not. But I don't know if, don't think it does, honestly. <laughs> Gotta play it anyway. Might do it this way. I can guarantee this is gonna activate now. 
I'm screwed if they have any storm. Yeah, sure. That's that's literally what I died to now. But we've put them in a spot where if they don't have storm, I win. So as long as this doesn't do damage, and of course, Genesis Dragon. Just my luck. Oh, at least it was close. I mean, one turn difference. Yeah, it was, it was a long shot, but it was the only way I was going to have a chance at winning. Throwing up wards weren't going to help me at that point. I wouldn't have had the space to do it anyway. So I took the only route that was really available. <laughs> Hope to God. Wrong prediction. Uh, either one would have got me, it wouldn't have mattered, but... I was banking on the fact that I hopefully wouldn't have any. And that I'd be able to at least get one turn. This hand's a lot better than the last one. Mainly hard mulliganing for the early drops. I'm not comfortable versus sword decks, though, because there's a lot of stuff that can happen with sword decks. Especially when they're ambush sword. Yep, I'd say it's going to be a pep deck. Pepe deck on the way. Probably my worst nightmare. Just get in as much damage as I can and set up for an H and L. Because once that goes, I should be right. Now it's going to be much, 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 much more difficult. <laughs> I hate symbol, really? Oh, I would believe that 100%. Look at his ugly mug. Let's go full on h and Plus this way, Altered Fate actually has some decent play with it. <laughs> These organizations, who knows, honestly. Who knows. We try not to question the crazy organizations, we just play against them. Alright, that makes that a lot harder to kill because you've got to sack that and something else. <laughs> Eight nine ward, yes. Dies to like crazy crap, but it's the only chance I had left. They're not gonna take the trade, are they? That'd be absolutely crazy. I mean, you wouldn't want to do that, surely. And no, they don't, because they're not that stupid. I wish they were that stupid, but they're not. So my luck was definitely not in my favor. I do get to hit them for 8 though. That feels kind of good. I mean, I can kind of just stock up the board. That could work out. I mean, I'm dead if they play... Um, Dance of Death. That kills the ward. Alright, I'm fine with this. <laughs> there we go. Quick concede. Now I'm just floating at the 2k mark.
The risks of winning and losing. That H and Elf was an eight nine. It was huge. It was a huge H and Elf. Oh, fire! But I love you, fire. PvP meta right now? No, not really. Kinda, I guess. It's in a tier. It's a tier two list, so. Oh, well, I suppose you are pretty tired, aren't you? It's okay, fire. I'll forgive you if you doze off and disappear. Greg will just have to make up for it. <laughs> yeah, it's okay, Fire. I understand those 4 4 a.m. late night things. That was me last night when I was like, oh, I probably should go to sleep, but I want to read one more chapter of whatever I was reading. It was dinner time here. <laughs> uh, it's just whatever. Um, since I'm running on Australian time, I've still got to fit things around what I've got to do. And what I was streaming in the past was like really wonky for me. I found that streaming of a night for me is a lot easier. So right now it's what 9 p.m. coming on to. I started at roughly 7:30 ish, 8 ish. So for me, this is always the better way to go. Let's do it this way. I really like P2P Forest. It's like the only forest deck I actually like. I don't like any other forest much. I did play Roach for a while, but it just kind of bored the crap out of me. Now I wish I had something to deal with that easily, but I don't. Damn. It's okay. Hmm. Bramble, Fairy, Glimmer. Does overdraw. That's fine though. <laughs> That's okay, I'm glad when anyone does turn up. It's great. It's better than having like zero people here, which happens. Maybe for you, I prefer playing overnight. I play a lot better overnight than I do during the middle of the day. How do I want to play this hand though? I don't want to overdraw again. Maybe I just flood the board. Alright, so they're one off Vengeance, which is an okay spot. And the Razory Claw does put them into Vengeance. And then they can rev. Alright. What can I do now? Not much. Get lucky with these draws. Ooh, that was pretty lucky. H and Elf is a good blockade. We've still got Will of the Forest, so we've got the clear available. When Salt is present, that's kind of true. What do we got? I don't want to have to kill that. But I'm probably gonna 100% have to. Ah, <laughs> oh, fire, it's alright. Late Night League wouldn't hurt though, would it? Wink. I'm sure you do it all the time. Has to die. Oh, 
Oh, this is going to be interesting. Very interesting. Looking forward to next turn. I mean, that's absolutely devastating. But, I have a shot. Okay, now I have no shots because that just decimated me thanks to this. Give me another fall of Storm of Vengeance active. I did not expect Demon Commander. Not at all. I actually didn't really expect Lucifer, so that's kind of surprising. Like, I expected a bit there. Did not expect those. <laughs> uh, we've been doing alright. We're still positive win rate. So I'm pretty happy with it. Anything over 50 is still a pretty good deck. My worst matchup is Dragon. My next worst matchup is probably, I don't know, probably Blood, if I have a bad hand, I guess. I'm trying to work out what, I, what I'm weak against here. Haven is hit or miss, depending on variant. And Rune is not a hard matchup at all, unless D-Shift, in which case you're dead anyway, because you've got a control for too long, unless you get the early game. It can make a difference. Most cards are dead by now, Phil. Okay, free win. Take that. This guy didn't want to deal with my shit. Fine with me. <laughs> Don't worry, breadcrumbs. I understand that feel. Trust me. Mine may not be as bad as yours, but still pretty bad. I hate paying for crap in Australia, and it sucks. Like, I've been buying, for example, Switch games. Like, most of them, other than my physical stuff, all my digital stuff, I buy from, like, other country stores, because it's all, like, region-free now. I recently bought I Am Setsuna from the Canadian eShop store, because that was the cheapest way to buy it. Canadian eShops are actually not so bad with my conversion rate. Otherwise, I usually buy from the US or... That's pretty much it, actually. The US and Canada. Maybe I'll consider Japan if they have exclusive game. But at the moment, I haven't found anything. What do we got? Nothing useful yet. And blood is not a good matchup for me. Especially aggro blood style decks. Makes it really difficult. Now I'm going to be drawn out. Great. Don't really have a choice. <laughs> Three point five dollars. Jeez. Uh, Intesi takes. Mm, depends where it's coming from. From the mainland, if it's in Melbourne, it can be two days. If it's from Queensland, normally about three. And then anywhere else, like Western Australia range, Adelaide range, those sort of sides, or right up the top of Queensland areas, can take up to a week max. Outside of Australia is usually two to three weeks, depending on the shipping company and different, a lot of different factors that go into that. Water Fairy just leave, dude, yeah. Back when Water Fairy was like terrifying. Well, I've got a heap of stuff coming at the moment, mainly small things, like a tri-wing screwdriver and I've got a pop filter coming, I ordered one of those the other day, that should be here very soon, and a PS Vita game cart to SD card adapter, which I thought was an interesting product. Well, this is why blood is a bad matchup. Let's 
see. I don't have a choice but to get rid of this Urius. At least with Bramble, our trades are okay. I mean, we are dead to anything substantial. Yeah, I'm fucked. Blood's a bad matchup. It's not just the going second. PTP Forest relies on being able to control the early board. Coming up against Blood just completely derails that. I'm hoping for anything. Come on. Flux on my side here. Elf Child will hit anything but the 4 3. Fuck off. Come on. The only thing on board that I did not want Elf Child to hit. Gotta be joking. Not that it makes a big difference, but fuck me. Come on. Elf Child only had to hit any of these. I could have rammed the Roach, traded the rest of the board, and I think that would have cleared it, wouldn't it? Because we're about to go for almost a full clear here. Three frogging summon <laughs> That sounds about right for Tazzy, honestly. A lot of major news doesn't really happen. We don't have a lot of big events. Hobart gets a few, but... It's not... Not the craziest place to live, that's for sure. <laughs> Does a devil just mean really exist? <laughs> <I'll say don't. laughs> what? <laughs> there is Tasmanian devils, they're pretty cool. Little animals. Let's see what else I got here. I got control blood. We'll give that a shot. I mean, yeah, there isn't there isn't too much exciting that happens here. You're very late, Asha. <laughs> We're an hour 18 in at the moment. Probably got another 12 odd minutes. I was thinking hour and a half tonight. A little bit longer than my shorter streams, but shorter than my longer streams. So I don't stream forever like some other guys I know. Unfortunately, I just don't have the drive all the time. <laughs> Back when Crypt first started playing though, there was a lot more like skill and deck building involved. Now that they've added so many new RNG based cards, it's a real annoyance. It's not as bad as other games I've played, but it's starting to creep in there and I'm worried that it will eventually overtake things. Aggressive, yeah they are aggressive creatures, you don't want to be playing with them. Deadly Devils are dangerous, they're no different to say, what would I probably say they're like? Um. Rabid, f no, not rabid foxes, but wild foxes, you know, in the sort of way they could probably be aggressive. But you don't see them in that many places. I mean, you've got to go a fair way out of the out of your way to see them. They're not just going to randomly be there. Salamander, I'll take that. <laughs> That's right, man. It's okay. I'll take that. You turn up at all is always good. <laughs> That's true, they're not puppies. They definitely do have the reason to be called called devils, that's for sure. God, this this dragon though, if he doesn't heal soon, he could be in a bad spot. There were Tazzy Tigers too, but I didn't live to see them. Not unless there are some still alive somewhere in Tazzy, but there are areas we can't access. 
due to terrain. So it's always possible that they could live there, but it's highly unlikely. The numbers would be ridiculously small. It's not even worth playing that, is it? But I probably still should. Oh, maybe not. I don't know. I'm gonna go with it. Future new video. Is it a leak? Wait, what's what's a leak to a future new video? This deck? Because this deck's video comes out Thursday, and then PTP Forest is Friday. I'm ahead a fair bit at the moment, which for you will be like the day before, because time zones are a thing that exist. I've actually got videos done right up until next Sunday. I'm almost a week ahead at the moment on what I've done. How does winter look? Winter is horrible and I hate it. I hate winter. I hate being too cold. I like the in-between months. I'll settle for the in-between months any day of the year. Rev just seems like an absolute waste, but do I really have a choice? Makes a huge deal out of it. Oh dear. That would be weird. Mm, Temptress, evolve. It's five damage, puts us in a better spot. The whole deck's been swapped out so they can only rely on their hand for the most part. Cards in their deck, the chance of them having what they need is average, I guess. Will I build a summer all year? Yeah, it depends on where you are, that's for sure. Won't be easy to deal with, that's true. 13 13 will not be easy to deal with. Oh, new client. <laughs> Dying winter, yep. We have about two months of the year that are extremely hot for us because of, you know, temperature differences and the humidity. And the rest is usually pretty cold. Or on the warm side, I guess you could consider it. Right, save Scarlet, maybe. I like winter, I just don't like being an icicle. This deck is full control, yes. Full control. No shenanigans, full control deck. And this is my variation, there's a couple different ones out there now. It's based on another deck with modif enough modifications that it pretty much has a different function. No school. Oh yeah, summer used to be good. But after being out of school for a couple of years, you kind of get over that. Now every day just kind of blurs into one. That's going to be real annoyance though, isn't it? May as well just try and get what I can out of this. <laughs> don't worry breadcrumbs, we don't really get much snow either unless you go to the mountains. Or out to a lake in the middle of the in the state. Otherwise, we get very little snow. Well, actually, we get pretty much no snow. <laughs> Phil, that's exactly how the start of an adult life works. It's what am I doing now? Now that I don't have to spend every day going to school, then you have to pick what are you going to do? Are you going to do every day at work? Are you going to do every day something else? How am I going to deal with this? They had a really nice hand, considering. This is a crazy way to deal with Bahamut. I mean, I'm dead to a few cards, but... At least I'm trying to survive here. Hey, look, I knew I was going to die there. 
I'm going to college. <laughs> oh dear, that's one option, I suppose. But then depending on how you look at it, can you really count college as being being an adult life by then? Because you're still going to school pretty much 24-7, so that kind of sucks. Mm, I'll just finish off with the TRS. Expensive college, yeah. College would be expensive as fuck over there. It's not so great here, but we have a lot of gov government subsidies and loan stuff that can be done pretty easily. <laughs> Don't worry, Greg, I feel you. I feel you there. Like what? I finished... What is it? I finished year 12 almost three years ago now. Spent a year, nearly two years doing pretty much nothing due to medical stuff and now I've ended up doing this for the last nine-ish months, maybe more now. Actually, it would be more because we're in the eighth month now. Well, nearly 11 months. October will be a year since I started doing Shadowverse content at least. Instantly loses, yep. Story of my life. Two more years left to go. Yeah, that's the way to go, man. Just enjoy it. Take your time. Ignore other people. And just do what you want to do. It's the best way to spend it. That's how I spent most of my um, year 11 and 12. Was just doing whatever I wanted more so than anything else. I'll agree, he's a bit of a neighbor harasser. So young in this stream? Oh, breadcrumbs, it's okay. There are plenty of days where I just feel like, oh crap, am I really that old? It, was, it feels like only, you know, yesterday that I was, you know, 15, 16. Well, by the time I was in, what, year, uh, year 12? Yeah, pretty much. No, actually it would have been... Yeah, it was year 12 by that point. I don't mind Logan, but only for his content. I'm not a fan of him as a person. Soul Squasher. Feels good to me. <laughs> oh, the hate is dead back. Yeah, what do you do then? <laughs> I love the last bit that's like totally aired out. It's just like. Nope. Alright, I should be good from here. <laughs> That's what I was thinking, fire. Pretty sure we all understood that though in the end. Nope, <laughs> okay, now I'm confused. <laughs> Where should we go? Maybe the Cerberus? Cerberus always feels solid. I mean, we can drop the Coco anyway. Maybe even use this Evolve here. Deal some real damage to them. Why not? It's not gonna hurt. <laughs> they do a good job marketing themselves. 
That's for sure. They know their audience, so they know what they're aiming to do. Do they do a good job of that? Sure. Are they great people? Not really. <laughs> do they cause problems? Yes. Will they burn out? For sure. Give them another couple months and you probably won't hear from them. Look at things like Leafy and other, other big creators like that that were just created overnight and then pretty much gone. At most, usually most of those sort of people get a year tops of having having their having their big spotlighty moments. Which was my audience. <laughs> that would be pretty cool, honestly, yeah. If you're looking for money and stuff, it's a great way to do that. Underage girls. Yep, Greg. That's that's the way you do it. Tap into that market. Get everyone to love you. And be set for life. Your boy Killer Keemstar oh, won't there. After all the shit Keem's been through, he's never once, you know left for a long period of time. He spent some time off, had little breaks here and there, but not like completely just off and disappeared. Usually you know what's going on with him. Mind you, he's a terrible person. He makes good content, but terrible, terrible person. He basically just covers news. If you've ever seen Scare, similar to that, but more comedic, which is enjoyable. At least in my opinion, I find it enjoyable. Because the Civil, Civil War is so dumb. I'm pretty sure that's a publicity stunt. <laughs> Keemstar is like the TMZ of YouTube, but actually comically funny. They're not trying to not trying to condone to those edgy kid mentality. Talks about himself. Can't disagree with you there. I never found scarce that entertaining. Oh, Greg. You're out of the whole YouTube content war crap. I feel good for you. That's where you want to be. What do I want to do with this? I need like one damage. That's literally all I need here. Can I find the one damage that I need? I don't think I actually have an option for one damage, but we're going to try. He's to wear 50 flannels, oh. Let's see. We got nothing important now. Great. I'm just hoping these wards are enough. Plus, they aren't haven't got enough yet to play the Path to Purgatory if that's what they're aiming for. Awesome! My win. I think that's a good note to end on. <sighs> Alright guys. Hope you enjoyed chilling out here. I should be back tomorrow as long as everything goes well. I thank everyone who's came and if you haven't, check out the YouTube channel and everything else and I will catch you guys next time. See ya.